Hi, today we're gonna to do some work to help you be more assertive. Now, this came up, I got the idea to make a freestanding video because I was doing some work in my group yesterday and one of the women needed some help with that. And she was having another health issue, but she had identified that it was because she needed to be more assertive. And what I realized when we started doing this tapping for her was that the problem she wasn't, the problem was actually that she was equating, as many of you do, being assertive with being aggressive. And those are two very different things. It's not okay to be aggressive, but it is okay to be assertive. So come do this tapping with me. I think it's gonna, I think it's gonna be illuminating and make you feel a lot better about standing up for yourself, standing your ground and being assertive. Now, as with all my work, I do need to be sure that you have clicked below, show more and agree to my disclaimer because it's there. You can just pause me, I'm not gonna start without you. Now, below this video, I wanna tell you, you're missing, if you don't click show more, either stop me now or do it when I'm finished. If you don't click show more, you're missing out on some great stuff because I have an invitation for you to my private Facebook group where I'm working live on a regular basis, just for you. You do have to answer questions to get in, but not a big deal. Your invitation is there. And I also have a free gift that's something you can use again and again and again to see what's really underneath your pain or issue. You want this. So there's good stuff below this video in Show More. All right, so let's get started. And just think about needing to be more assertive. Just, just get into this for a minute. And some of you are going, oh, I can't do that. I can, I can actually feel you out there going, oh, oh, I can't do that. Ooh, mm -mm, no, not me. So here we go, outside of the hand. I'm just not assertive. I'm not comfortable being assertive, but I choose to be okay anyway even though I need to be more assertive. My life would be easier if I could stand up for myself. I choose to be okay anyway, because I profoundly love and accept myself. Even though I think I'm just not assertive, I'm open to shifting my perspective on this now, because I do completely love and accept myself. I wonder if it might be possible that my idea about being assertive or not being assertive was formed in childhood. Maybe I was around someone who was really aggressive. Maybe they were loud. Maybe they made me feel small. I may have felt powerless around people and situations. There was no way I could stand up for myself. And so I learned that I couldn't be assertive. I couldn't defend myself energetically about all of that aggression. But I'm all grown up now. And I give myself permission to understand that there's a big difference between being assertive and being aggressive. And if I look around in my life, I can see there are some clear examples out there for me to watch of people who are assertive and stand up for themselves. And they do it in a way that isn't aggressive and they're not mean or nasty about it. They simply stand in their own power and hold their ground. 
well, I can't do that, at least not yet. But I'm open to the possibility that maybe I can step into that. If I let go of the need to be aggressive, it's not useful to me. So I turn loose of the need to be aggressive and to have that around me. It's safe to let go of this. And now I allow myself to remember that I am a contributing member of our species. And that I'm here because the universe thought I needed to be. I may even be a powerful eternal being. I'm willing to consider that possibility. And if that's really the case, then of course I have value and worth. Of course I deserve to stand up for myself. And because I am this wonderful being, it's safe to allow myself to relax and to know that I can always speak clearly and with compassion. There's no need for me to be aggressive or try to push anyone. All I'm doing is having clear boundaries. And I allow myself to understand that when I feel better and relax and have clear boundaries, everything works better. And then I can be assertive and I can feel good about standing up for myself because I do completely love and accept myself. I deserve to have good boundaries. Peace. Great. All right. I think that should help. Now, before you go, please subscribe to me. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button, but definitely subscribe. And there's a reason for that. YouTube's algorithm shows my work to more people who've never seen it based on the number of subscribers I have. That means if you took two seconds to hit that subscribe button, somebody who needed help from me today might get it two seconds. Just hit the button. And I look forward to seeing you again soon. Mwah.